think there are special moments in time when a whole series of things come together. You had a young band, Oasis, just ruling the world. It was this surge, this tidal wave of culture that suddenly dominated. I was loving it. Everything was getting bigger and better. Music was changing, politics was changing, football was changing. It was a great generation. Manchester reinvented itself. The football teams, of course, especially United, is a symbol of that. I think growing up in Manchester in the 90s was brilliant. It was just six young lads who were enjoying life. From an early age, they were just all about the focus and it worked. Six lads from the youth team have gone through and regulars now in the United team. We were doing everything that you wanted to do with the badge that you wanted to wear, winning. I think in our eyes, we were just playing a game of football with our mates. We didn't realise how special it was at the time. All we were worried about was staying in the team and doing well. We were part, probably, of a revolution, in a way. You run away celebrating, you tell your top bottom. You don't like that. <laughs> I never thought that I would have to go through what I went through. It was sickening. It was bordering on criminal, some of the things that he had to put up with. No matter what we'd been through, we all had each other's back. One thing that the Times did represent was to be greater together than you were alone. I think winning the European Cup massive is the greatest feeling in the whole wide world. It was a kind of hope get back into everything, you know, and it was a great time of change and it's party time, you know, it was good times. We were playing for the biggest club in the world. This was more special than anything that I've been involved in through my whole life.